Turn now to breaking news for our viewers in the West. After a two week manhunt, the escape killer in Pennsylvania has been caught. Trevor Alt has been there for us from the very beginning. He has the latest on how it all unfolded. Good morning, Trevor. Good morning, Lindsay. After nearly two weeks on the run, evading capture on more than a dozen possible sightings and even dodging gunfire from one homeowner, officials have just announced moments ago Danilo Cavalcante, that convicted killer, is once again in custody. This morning, convicted murderer Danilo Cavalcante has finally been captured after nearly two weeks on the run in this densely wooded area of Pennsylvania. I'm proud to announce the subject is in custody. The news comes after authorities had tightened their search perimeter, warning Cavalcante, who escaped from jail doing this crab walk up the exercise yard wall, was now armed with a weapon. He is now armed with a 22 caliber rifle with a scope and flashlight mounted on it. Police say he obtained that rifle from an open garage, having a face-to-face -face confrontation with the homeowner who pulled out a pistol and fired several shots, but Cavalcante escaped unscathed. It's terrifying, to say the least. Talia Therialt lives next door, law enforcement quickly swarming her neighborhood. They came out of the woodworks. We have helicopters over top. We have police officers everywhere, undercover, marked, FBI. We have tactical guys going through our woods in camo with large ARs. Officials say after a different sighting Monday, they found Cavalcante's prison shoes, but a pair of work boots were reported stolen nearby. Authorities urging everyone to lock up their homes and vehicles. He's killed two people previously. I would suspect that he's desperate enough to use that weapon. And while Cavalcante slipped through the police perimeter multiple times, even at one point stealing a van, it appears he never made it outside of Chester County.